What's up guys and welcome back, we're here with another part of our 1212 AD campaign as the Kingdom of Jerusalem and Cyprus. And we have declared war on the Ayyubid Sultanate in the last episode. If you haven't checked out the last episode or the ones before that, I recommend you do so, so you get up to date on what's going on. So, we have decided to declare war on the Ayyubids, basically because of our papal standing going down, it's hurting our public order. And in 10 turns, uh, it's going to go down again. So I'm going to just get on with it. I'm going to jump in uh, and we're going to try and fight the Ayyubid Sultan. Uh, many of my allies have joined me. So hopefully we'll get some, hopefully we'll get some support there. Um, I, the reason why I realized my income has gone down so much that I mentioned it in the last episode is because the trade agreement with Ayyubid is broken. So clearly it was bringing about a thousand... Um, like coin or well, gold it was on its own so that's kind of major but it's gone now so anyway yes we've declared war on the Ubids and we've encountered the Saraphate of Mecca but we are probably going to uh, let this end it's looking fairly good we're definitely going to just go for one turn and I'll probably go and do the siege myself and um, because it's taking Jerusalem and we've got to do that ourselves of course um, this army I don't really know what I want to do with it. Uh, I don't know if I really wanted to, if there was anything I was going to build. Um, no, we're building a church there. We've kind of everything's going okay here. This is still going down my minus five. Instability is going to make it minus two a turn. Um, and Catholic Christianity is still going down, which is because we've still not got a church here, which is what I'm probably going to put in. Because I don't really need to defend this too much. I think it's garrison's okay. But I could be wrong. Um, where's this garrison? Of course. Um, it's okay. I mean, I've seen better. We'll see. I think I'll go with the church next. Because it's, we've got no immediate threats over here now. So the Seljuks are kind of tied up with fighting elsewhere. And the Nicenes aren't coming back because we made peace with them. So we're going to end the turn. I'm going to see what uh, the Ayyubids do. Whether they come to relieve Jerusalem. Or they may just go straight for Akka and <laughs> try and take that from me. Which is also quite a high possibility. But we're probably going to start to... I guess I could have possibly got rid of some of those cheaper units. And start putting in some more elite stuff. But I'll start that next turn, I guess. Getting through all these turns. Very nice. All these factions, anyway. So anyway, guys, if you've... Uh, okay, the Seljuks of Rum. It is not often that he is moved to mercy. That's high. I don't really want to make peace with them. I know they sh I probably should just protect Rhodes. But I mean, Silesia and Antioch are still in this war. I'm going to say no. Um, also, they don't really seem to be doing a lot. So they don't seem to be the end of the world having them as an uh, enemy right now. But anyway, guys, before I was really interrupted there by the Seljuks, um, thank you for the support uh, with the likes and subscribes on the past videos. Um, I couldn't, and all the comments as well. Um, really greatly appreciated. Uh, so, um, just keep it up, guys, is what I'm going to say before Thessalonica just interrupts. Um, join war against Bulgaria. Um, and no, I mean, I would, but I don't really want to just get dragged into more wars unnecessarily, so I'm going to say no. A thousand is lovely offer, but I'm kind of fine. Yes, okay, so we've got more political support. A faction encountered a Marinid Sultanate. Uh, Jerusalem is military invested. And we have Warcry. Um, rank gain, Francois and Bohemond. And these guys have gained some households. Okay. Um, Besieging settlement. Um, eight turns until it breaks. They've got one barricade available. Um... They've got one ram and one ladder. I mean, what have they got then? The only thing is, is I always remember is those goddamn siege towers, which are just like hell to try and uh, to break. Well, not to break, to uh, destroy those siege towers. So I might try one more turn. We'll go. Oh, actually, could I get. No, that's going to take. I'll just get ladders then. We take this settlement! Get ladders. Um, Akka can build stuff. I don't know if I really want um, that. I could just I could just buy some stuff. Um, or the swords. Has this one already got swords then in it? 
No, I could have recruited them, but now I can't. Um, interesting. Interesting. So I could have recruited them, but I can't now. Um, I mean, I know I can't get any more Pule Knights. Um, I might just get two Order Cavalry. They're fairly good. I mean, they're basically the same as the Templar Mounted Knights. Um, or I could just get some Turkopoles. They're pretty expensive, though. Um... There's actually, actually, this army hasn't got much range in it, so let's get two Templar crossbows, definitely, um, and then we'll go for, then we'll think about what we want from there. In, see, so yeah, it's minus three now. It's going to be minus one, but all the instability's gone, and then I don't know really. It's going to be, it's going to be very close. I really do need to get something else here, but growth, um, growth next turn thirteen. If required for population surplus. 11, so I mean, I'm going to have like a bit. Um, Jerusalem's clearly still not going to be relieved. Um, I'm going to disband two of these units um, of these guys, and we're going to just recruit some uh, arm, some of these chaps. Thank you. I didn't really want to scroll to the other end, but thank you anyway. So yeah, we'll get two of these uh, slightly better spears, Templar sergeants. Um, and we'll see what happens there. I might also see if there's any diplomacy I can do. Oh, I can see the void chip of relation now. Today's can I briefing. trade? No. I don't really want to just get a non-aggression because I imagine I'll get dragged into a war with you at some point. Marin and Sultan. Oh, they are a no matter horde, in fact. I doubt I could do much with them. Um, and we can now see the Kingdom of Mercuria My down here, who are at war. The um, they want high, um, and I demand 1,200. Yep, yep, I can do that. Um, I can take your 900 quid off you. Uh, and then we could, that's about it, that's all we can really see. I can see the Empire Trebe Trebizond as well. They're at war with a lot of people that I welcome, kind of don't welcome, care about. Um, Empire Trezebond, I'm going to ex demand 900 from you. Because that's what everyone else has been doing. Seljuk Pretenders, they are without a settlement. You say so they clearly must be having some trouble over there. Um, the pleasures of my household. Don't really need anything from you. Uh, I don't think I really need any anything from anyone else. Still can't quite see beyond. I can't see France and anyone else over there. So we'll probably just end the turn. Um, I, I could build a cattle herd shed thing, but I don't really need it. Um, Acre. That's just gonna put maintenance and food down. But I guess we could get it. We'll get a uh, Saint Les Saint Lazarus's thing going. Um, and then we'll end the turn. Oh no, we've got skills that we need to do. Um. Authority, so we'll do public order, sure. Uh, and research, yeah, sure, we'll have research. Um, wealth, yeah, and that, yeah, done. Right, so hopefully we will be in a better position next turn. We will try and attack Jerusalem and take it for ourselves. Because, I, I mean, I can also resolve it, definitely. Um, I mean, hopefully... <laughs> Touch wood, no Ayubid armies turn up and just go, hello, we're just uh, going to come here and take this uh, take this army out. Uh, defensive alliance, um, that's moderate, I'm just going to say yes to that. Um, I've got a lot of alliances now, so I mean, but then most of Christendom likes me. So, uh, who knows? I mean, also I should have gone back up and papal standing because I've declared war on the Ayubids. That was a mission that I needed to do. Oh, and the Ayubids are just going to let Jerusalem be taken it seems. So, uh, we'll probably take it next turn. I don't know what... All their armies must be in this like, north against um, Trebizond or in the very, very south against Mercuria. So they're like kind of split. But we'll see. I'm going to try and take... Oh, okay. There's something going on down there which I can't see. And the Celtic Def Pretenders be destroyed. Okay. And we made an defensive alliance. Excellent. Well, I expect no less. So now, let's see what our chances are taking Jerusalem. A lot higher. Um, I could auto resolve, but I'm going to go in. 
We're going to fight this. We're going to take this for ourselves. Because we must take the Holy City. And I want to see Jerusalem. We haven't seen any of these units either yet on the uh, on the battlefield. So it's worth, worth a go. We'll have a look. See what's going on. I mean, they've not got anything great themselves. A lot of archers. I mean, I nearly matched them for archers. Yeah, they've got one less. They've got cavalry. I've got cavalry and a lot of spears. Pikes could be handy. Um, but we'll see. I mean, it looks like a basic fort settlement. It looks very, very square, very regular. So, um, yeah, we'll see what happens. So we are back on the battlefield and we have... Uh, I'm just going to set up quickly. Um, we've got a lot of towers. Uh, not a lot of towers, a lot of ladders. Look at all these ladders we have and a lot of rams. Um, which we're not going to need all of. I can tell you that. Um, probably need the one ram. Uh, and we will... Uh, we'll put you about here. We'll put you about here. I mean, oh, actually, I can. I was about to say, I can't see many of these dreaded towers, but there's one lot there. To be fair, there's only one lot, and then we can go straight up. So I'm gonna, that's what I'm going to do. I'm probably just going to put the one... Worry about this one area. Um, and we could possibly... Well, I don't need this ram. I'm, oh, no. That's that one. <laughs> no, we need that ram. Um, archers, you're definitely not going on... Um, on... Ladders, because that is just a bad idea. Pikes probably also shouldn't go on ladders. Um, but we're going to do it anyway. We've got spears and ladders. That's a pretty bad decision. Actually, no, we're going to take the pikes off ladders. Um, have you, like, there. That's fine. And we will then put the swords here on um, something. And then we'll probably gonna have um i'm just don't know i'm probably just gonna put this cav at the back uh, like so i'm just gonna have it like here and then arches um should probably be up to, uh, actually no put all the cav a little bit further back actually we'll just have it like we'll set the sergeants can go here and all the other stuff can go here arches can go about here and we'll uh general can just sit behind those chaps Okay, so we'll start. Um, let's just give the attack orders and then we can just admire everything. Um, I was going to say, excuse me, I can definitely... Uh, I'll go there, that's probably as far... Oh god, there's a lot of stuff on the walls. I mean, that's kind of expected, to be fair. Uh, <laughs> and then we'll go to about here. Uh, perfect, right, let's have a look at some of these stuff. Let's have a look at some of this stuff. What is these? What, what are these? Sorry. Uh, Templar Spear Sergeants. They, they look pretty cool. With their uh, black and white. They look very nice, actually. Gosh, yes. I mean, this looks very... This doesn't look very much like Jerusalem, I will not lie. I mean, I'm pretty sure Jerusalem would be bigger. More Templar Spear Sergeants. Marching up in order with their Crusader Commander. Oh, I was going to say, you got not got the attack order to move up. Keep going. Keep going. I didn't tell you to stop. Uh, where are the hospitalers? This is what I want to look at. One of these are like the slightly better spears that I've got going. Um, oh, yes. they look. I mean, they've just got like basic chainmail. And they've got a few of them. We've got the hospitaler white cross on. We've also got uh, Templar crossbows. These guys are pretty damn cool. Very similar to the other ones. Uh, Syriac crossbows over here. Yes, you can see why they're Syriac. They've got like their turbans and uh, colourful clothes. What have we got here? We've got Poulet Knights. Oh, very colourful. All of their coats of arms. Uh, we've got General's Bodyguard back there. He looks pretty damn elite. I'm, I'm actually probably just going to start looking now. Because we've probably got to get, uh, get a shuffle on. Um, okay, so we've got some spears on the wall. Some archers, Susanese archers. Okay, this this <laughs> arrow tower is reaching quite a long way. I'm not gonna lie. Don't think you should be able to get that far. Actually, it's a, what am I saying? What am I saying? These things are like nuclear missiles. Um, how far? Oh my gosh, we're taking a lot of casualties and getting to this wall. Like far too many casualties. Um, let's just bring the rest of you up here. 
I might take a lot more casualties than expected. <laughs> Get in there. Uh, kill these guys, please. Yeah, already that unit's broken. Wow, they actually got it to the wall but broke. Get onto the walls. There's no way we're going to break these lot down. Um, let's just move them a little bit closer. So that the arrow towers might shoot some other people. That don't include... What's here then? Um, no, come this way please. I don't really want to go down there and fight you on your own. Um, you need to come up here. Swords are in. Excellent. Right, this is where we're going to overflow them. This is where we're going to overflow them, and we're going to get them all here. Nice. And we're going to get them through the gates as well, of course. And then we're going to bring cavalry in. Um, ten plus sergeants. Yeah, they're breaking. No surprise. Let's just get all the cavalry in the middle. That's a bit near. <laughs> um... Yeah, we can actually. Yeah, you can go up that way. That works. There's so many like arrows going off over it. God damn it! Stop killing them. Um, is the gates down at all? Sixty-seven. Excellent. Right. So you're nearly dead. Can nearly finish with this utter rubbish. Uh, get over here, please, Pikes. I don't want you just. Messing around in the wrong spot. Get up here. Oh my god, they're just firing like directly over the top and just like. That's not even an angle. That's not a viable angle. They'll go that way, kill them. But I mean, we're breaking these guys pretty easy. They're pretty trash units, I think. Yeah, just get in a formation and get these guys straight away. Let's see these pikes in action then. These Poulain pikes. Oh my gosh! They have so many flags! Well, good for them. Good for them. Um, actually, yeah, definitely combat these guys. They are a problem. Deprived of our siege equipment, eh? Oh, they destroyed the ram. Can we get in? We can. Oh, it's just going to get destroyed. It's just going to disappear. You know, that's a real problem. There we go, get in. Um, and then you go that way. Actually, eh. What are they firing? Oh, there's catapults firing but at something, but I'm not quite sure what. I'm sorry we're not getting many close-ups at the moment. I'm just still a little bit worried about some of the stuff that's going on. I uh, don't know if I actually wanted to do that. Gavary, kill these guys, please. Just kill all of them. Yeah, but I kind of wanted him to be under attack. I told him. Be under attack. Uh, yeah, kill all these guys, please. Um, oh my gosh, just look at it. It's like a hellfire. I'm going to go... Oh, and they've got a general here that's like... Oh, he's Tabadar here. Ooh, I'm going to get all my cavalry apart from my general. Kill this Tabadar here. <laughs> Kill it. Kill it now. Um, Pikes. Kill these guys. Swords. Kill these guys. Can they not go the other way? It seems not. Oh, there's a barricade there, of course, of course. Um, destroy that, please, then. Don't really know if I really want my cavalry to come through here, then. Uh, actually, yeah, just keep ready, keep pushing through. Keep pushing through with all this cavalry. Um, and you keep focused down there. Are you going to knock that down quickly? I don't know. Not really quickly enough. We control that. Excellent. Um... Don't really. I mean, I've got a lot of beaten up units. Some of these will definitely need uh, 
some time to replenish. Okay, let's just keep moving along. Keep charging. Yeah, we've won this. Jerusalem is definitely ours, ladies and gentlemen. Jerusalem is ours. Um, can we destroy this? 63? Uh, well, if they're breaking and not going to die, that's fine. I'd rather just broke and didn't die. Go down there, you fools. Go down there. <laughs> Just look at this horde of cavalry. Uh, <laughs> oh god. This is not how you fight siege battles, really. <laughs> you definitely need more infantry, but um, I am definitely need to get through this in these temple sergeants there and get some more swords in. They're just not quite good enough. Just not quite good enough. Um, but you are finished. You can now charge that way. There we go. Charge. Um, pikes, why not? Go and fight them. Oh my god, actually it is turning. It's done a 180. This thing is still firing at us. You cheeky thing. Go kill them. Let's get free shots at us. Um, yeah, we'll just kill, just kill this off quickly, please. Let's just see what these Tabadere are going to do then. I mean, they look, they look pretty damn elite, I will admit. But I mean, can they deal with some Pule Knights? I mean, it's an uphill charge. It is going to be hard. Here we go. Oh, no. It's still an uphill charge. It's still going to be a problem for them, it would seem. Um, and then the general arrives. He can... Oh, I should have done fast charge, damn it. Oh, well, I'll just have that now. <laughs> uh, more cavalry coming. This is more Templar Sergeant. Uh, Mountain Sergeants. Oh, gosh. Yeah, these guys are going to crush... Them. And I mean, here come the here come the Templar sergeants of their own. Not the Templar sergeants. The um, well, the tower's gone now. So I mean, that's gonna stop any hopes of uh, just actually just take that. Just get in there and take that. There's no need for you to be supporting here. Spearman, ready. Yeah, we're breaking these guys. Keep breaking. Kill the uh, kill the Saracens. They don't deserve to hold the holy city. It is our right. God wills it. Deus Vault. I mean, come on, these type of rear, they can't last long, much longer. I mean, they're chopping up horses left, right, and center. I can hear a lot of horses going down, crying. Well, let's just pull. Let's just pull my general out. We don't really need to just get him killed for no reason. Um, see if we can pull these cavalry through. Yes, we can. A lot died, though. Oh, so many died. Definitely wasn't worth it. Oh, and they broke anyway. There we go. They broke just like that. Excellent. Right, so we've taken that. Finally, we can end the battle. Jerusalem is ours, ladies and gentlemen. We have taken it. We lost 400 men. Um, I don't know whether that would have been the same amount with some of the other, um, with the auto-resolve, but, uh, I mean, that unit didn't even get any, any kills, and it just got massacred. That was, that poor unit had to just go into the breach and just assume it was going to die. But I will see you guys back on the, uh, on the map in a moment. Well, that was quicker than expected. Um, so, I mean, there you go. He's getting murdered. Poor bugger, he's got murdered. So we will just end that and we will occupy. There will be no sacking of the city. It's Jerusalem. It's the holy city. Um, I'm going to just destroy this. Destroy this. Um, and I'm going to destroy that. And I'll repair that because I could easily convert that. There we go. Did we lose any units? No, we still have 20 out of 20. Excellent. So there's going to be a lot of replenishment that's going to take time here. 16 turns. Yikes. Well, not 16 turns. 16 men a turn. So five turns. So we, But we have the Holy City. So that is excellent. I'm going to go and spy on Homs now. Homs is my next target that I'd like to go for. Um, and it is unoccupied. So that is perfect. And it's a fairly similar garrison. 
So the 10,000 will have that duty of taking this. Um, whether I will um, send them in with... I kind of want to send in them with all the swords. Or... Um, I mean, if I could get some dismounted Templars, that would be great. But I don't think I can. Um, so we're kind of lacking on the sword from what to get. Um, but we'll, we'll get something. We'll get something going. Um, I'm definitely going to put a church in here. Um, and possibly a a recruiting station of some sort. A, recruit, a military thing of some sort. And a... I don't know what else. Possibly just something for public order. Um, I have money. Uh, what else has happened? Decides a victory. Okay. We killed Musa, the governor. Uh, Jerusalem has been secured. Imperium has gone up. We have noteworthy now. And Jerusalem has been occupied. Excellent. So I could get a third army going. But I won't yet. Good, that's on zero. We don't need to worry about that as of yet. I'm probably just going to put a... Um, a commander in. Can I adopt someone? I can't. I kind of want to adopt some of these people. You're a... Um, do you have a job? Aubrey. Bermond. No, you don't. Francois Ferdinand. Um, you just take Jerusalem. There we go. Done. Dusted. Um, I'm gonna put you on... I don't know. I think I'll put you on Settled Tribes. Um, the growth can always be handy. Don't know what we'll... Uh, I guess we still need some stuff here. Um, so we will end the turn. Actually, what's... Uh, let's see. I don't think we could probably do anything with anyone. Still can't see anyone new. It's pretty useless. I mean, Georgia... What can we do? Your still only... I kind of wish we got trade. Fight. I don't really want a defensive alliance with you just for the sake of it. You are also at war with the Ubids as well, so they're probably occupied up there as well. But anyway, we can end the turn, and we'll see what happens. Hopefully, I don't have any more... I should uh, complete that mission. I mean, they re they regave me that mission, I'm pretty sure, after Defensive Alliance, we and they demand 100 quid. Yeah, you can have a Defensive Alliance as it is. Asking for 100 quid off me? That's not happening. Get out of here. Oh, uh, yes, I'm at war with these guys as well. Because of Pisa, I think. I'm not sure. One or the other. Either Pisa or Sicily asked me to join this war. Um, so, we're in that war. But, I mean, I doubt they're going to... If they come all the way across to me, they've got a problem. Um, the Seljuks. Just moving some stuff around. The Seljuks have been most, the most passive um, enemy I think I've ever seen. Uh, the Ubids now are... Still not actually replying. They must be... Their armies must be somewhere. I need to, I can't overextend too much. I'm probably going to go for Homs, then Damascus. So then an Akka's defended on all fronts. Um, by, a, by one of the cities there. Like, that's what I need to just keep an eye on. And then after that, we can go for anything else. That was Iranian Separatists, wasn't it? Iranian Separatists. And we got 10,000. Ah, so we must have. It's probably going to say, well done, you've done it. I don't know. Who knows? <laughs> well done, you've done it. Well done, you've taken the city. Uh, Jerusalem, um, thingy majiggy, uh, Milan, Catholic Priory, provincial capital city. Uh, I don't know. Maybe uh, let's just to convert all this stuff. Let's convert. Oh, actually, yeah, that's a good point. We can use all this money just to convert everything. That's a perfect move, actually. Um, wealth from culture, public order. I could do a local domesne, I guess. Um. A tavern, a bazaar, gibbets, uh, gibbets, um, jousting? I guess I could, but I don't really want it. I kind of want a uh, noble domesne. So I'm going to get it a noble domesne, I think. And then I'm going to put a. I don't know. Could put you in, or a Catholic church. I'm going to put a military order priory in. And then we can't do either of you, but that's fine. We'll sort you out in a few turns' time. Um, um, let's see. I could do with having... Um, I don't know. A ducal estate could be handy. All navies. Well, we don't have navies yet, so that's not really the end of the world. Um, I'll go with a Catholic abbey. 
That's fine. We'll have a Catholic Abbey and um, I could just disband a few more of these chaps and just get some more guys in. So there, we'll do, we'll do that. Let's just uh, disband a few more of you chaps, and we will uh, put in some. I've got some Terrell spears. I still have a lack of infantry. To be fair, it's going to be more Templar sergeants. Um, or Templar, yes, spear sergeants. So that's unfortunate that we have to stick with them, but we'll we'll stick with them, it would seem. Um, but anyway, guys, we're probably going to have to wrap up the episode there. We have finally taken Jerusalem. Um, it is ours. We can we can move on to taking Damascus and Homs next, which are my next two targets. Um, so that is the plan. I probably actually could put this guy in the 10,000. I might do that later when Homs has been taken. Then we can move down to somewhere like Aquaba. That's definitely not right. And then on... Definitely not right, sorry. Um, and then we can move on to Alexandria and we can take these settlements for ourselves. I mean, it looks like the Mamluks are doing a decent amount of damage over here themselves. Um, so anyway, guys, if you've enjoyed and you're new around here, please leave a like and subscribe uh, to join the Papal Legion. And until next time, guys, 